Andrew McGahan for Severe MMA, standing alongside Conrad Ivanovsky. Conrad, I was saying to you there, <laughs> so all four of your pro fights, you seem to improve dramatically in each one, but that one was a real, real test of courage. Uh, that one's a real punishment, I have to say, for me. A uh, guy was extremely strong stand-up. Um, he put all his strength to, to knock me out. He wanted to badly to knock me out. And uh, that's actually, that's how he lost it because he used all the power in his first few punches, first minutes. And um, after, I was actually, I wasn't thinking about that, but after uh, when I take him down on the, uh, about, I don't know which minute, that was fourth slam. minute. And I, big slam one, yeah. I felt him when he's heavy breathing. And that was my time when he turned to a turtle. I say, I have to then try for submission because he doesn't have much energy to scramble that submission. So that's why I go for the rear naked choke. Plus, I I seen him losing by rear naked choke. So I say, fuck it, try it. There was um, a moment as well. It looked like you were going for a judo throw, and he stepped yeah. out of the way. It looked like he actually went head first down onto the mat. Did mm -hmm. is that a strong impact? Did you feel it? Uh, say again, sorry. Uh, well, you went to the judo throw, but it looked like you landed on your head. I thought uh, it might have hurt you, hurt yourself. I can't remember that to be honest with oh, you. So, so maybe you did hurt yourself, you can't remember it. No, no, I don't know. What second was that? It was against the fa fence, isn't it? Against the fence. He, he knew me to the face. No, uh, no, it wasn't. He didn't hurt me with that. No, I felt just blink for a sec, but going forward. And as well, when it went to the ground, then you were going for a lot of footlocks and heel hooks. Is yeah. that again, you knew submission def defense may not have been up to standard? No, this guy had me from the back position and I, I for save my energy to uh, not, uh, you know, struggling with him in the wrestling, I decided to go to the leg lock or something. And uh, from there, I just was keep moving. Uh, that's only was my reaction because if I, if he would be, his back would be against the fence, then I have a movement to rip off that grip and just walk away from him. But I didn't have much space, so I just whatever. That's how I felt in this situation to do it. That wasn't any special something for him or anything. So four very good wins there. I heard you mention you're looking to get back out as quick as possible. Uh, to the K uh, Clan Wars, is that? Or no, K uh, Cage Wars. Cage Wars, yeah, next one in August. Um, no, just another fight. Another, another opponent, another preparation, another weight cut, another excitement. And hopefully in the next interview with you. Exactly. Well, one final thing, because you said that you had seen him get submitted before, mm -hmm. but he has a very uh, good record. He's beaten a lot of good guys. Were you, were you a little bit more confident taking that because you knew of his submission defense? No, I think because I'm brave. No, um, I'm believing, you know, it's because he has a good, uh, big record. That doesn't mean he's it's great, you know. It's about, as well as I said in an earlier interview on this show, uh, it's about a lot about the heart. If you have a heart, if you in some situations, no matter what's going to happen, how good the guy, you aren't going to lie down and just let him beat you, isn't it? So if my coach says, you know, I can beat him, I can beat him, he knows. He wouldn't, uh, he wouldn't uh, Andy Ryan and uh, John Donnelly, Pod Ramon, who do my corner. If those guys don't think I can win the fight, he would, they wouldn't put me. If they believe I can do it, this, why not? Excellent, Connor. Okay. Appreciate the time. Appreciate See you in uh, August 17th. August 17th at the Cage, uh, Cage Warriors. Yeah. Big thank you, of course, as always, in all in the view to my team uh, Tim Rhino, Andy Ryan, uh, Jimmy Courtney, John Donnelly, uh, Paul Ramon, do my corner. And uh, my sponsor, Fanatic Shop, uh, uh, Lancer Nutrition, and of course, thank you to Clan Wars to give me a chance for a title. First one in pro, very happy. Excellent, Conrad. Appreciate thank it you. for your interview, Blow. Thank you.